Turkish firm FNSS has tested whether the Zaha armored amphibious assault vehicle can come back to upright position in case of capsizing in water, reported Defense World. The new generation amphibious vehicle features a water-resistant hull and demonstrates superior amphibious characteristics. Its completely sealed hydrodynamic hull offers self-riding capability and improves mobility in water as well as on land. Zaha Armored Amphibious Vehicle built for Turkish Marine Corps has completed self-correction test. It has ability to rotate itself in case it capsizes, without harming the crew inside and without using an additional system. With this test, verification activities have been completed. Qualification tests of the vehicle will start, Ismail Demir, Chairman of Presidency of Defense Industries SSB, tweeted Thursday afternoon. Turkey begins testing Zaha Armored Amphibious Assault Vehicle FNSS will deliver a total of 27 vehicles to the Turkish military, 23 are personnel carriers, 2 command and control vehicles, and 2 rescue vehicles. The body design and strong water jets give Zaha high mobility with a maximum speed of 7 knots at sea and 70 km per hour on land. Zaha which can climb 60% steep slope, can easily cross 90 cm high obstacles and 2 meter wide ditches. Zaha has high firepower with its remote control turret fitted with a 12.7 mm machine gun and 40 mm automatic grenade launcher. The MAV's design configuration enables the operators to launch the vehicle from landing platform docks LPD, during amphibious assault missions. Turkey is expected to use its LPD Anadolu to deploy the MAVs. Zaha MAV can be manned by a crew of three members including a commander, a driver, and a gunner. The driver is positioned in the front, while the commander's hatch follows the driver's hatch. Located in the middle of the vehicle, gunner's compartment offers a clear view of the surroundings and allows the gunner to track down enemy movements. A large compartment at the rear end can carry cargo and 21 dismounted troops. It is fitted with a hydraulic ramp that allows troop ingress and egress. <laughs>